Yesterday, the New England Patriots defeated the New York Jets by a final score of 25 to 22, pulling off yet another huge upset. Drake May unfortunately suffered a concussion that prevented him from finishing the game. Although he must follow protocol, the rookie quarterback wanted to play again. Future Hall of Famer Aaron Rodgers made public remarks regarding May and his performance after the game. It's obvious that Rodgers loves the rookie quarterback. Rodgers remarked, I think he was doing a nice job on his feet. He is clearly quite athletic. He ran well and scored a touchdown. I have no idea what became of him. However, for the past several weeks, he has been playing well. Arriving as a rookie quarterback is difficult, but he appears to be growing more at ease. May has done a fantastic job of demonstrating his ability to be a franchise quarterback thus far this season. He has demonstrated his exceptional talent. May has completed 564 yards, five touchdowns, and two interceptions on 63.1% of his pass attempts. With 114 yards and a touchdown on 13 tries, he has also had an impact on the ground. May has demonstrated remarkable poise and assurance at the young age of 22. Additionally, he has already assumed a leadership position. Given what they have witnessed thus far, the Patriots must be thrilled. Related video? What happens if the Jets lose to the Patriots without Aaron Rodgers? The facility, Fox News. Should we keep Aaron Rodgers for next year? Mm -hmm. What are we going to do with Devontae Adams? Should we sign Gary Wilson? Obviously, who's going to be the next head coach? It's going to be so many questions in New York if they lose this game and you fall to two and six. Because I ain't going to lie. Those are my brothers. Y'all know we FaceTimed them and all that on the show. Those, those are my brothers. If you go to two and six, it's a wrap. I don't care nothing about no 2% chance or none of that. It's a wrap, right? Now, as you're taking the field, how can I stay healthy so I can get to Cabo and chill with the girly, whatever, the wife, whatever, because it's over. You're not going to the playoffs. It's too many solid teams in the AFC that you ain't going to be able to climb back up the hill and get into the playoffs. It's not happening. And if you go to two and six, the signs say you ain't a good football team, period, anyway. Yeah, that's true. You know, so for Aaron Rodgers and the New York Jets, it's going to be so many questions if you lose this game that the owner, Woody, is going to have to answer because he has done everything. He done got Hassan Reddick in the field. He got Dante Adams over there. He flew the Jets to go get you, Aaron Rodgers. You got a really good defense. So if you lose this game, it's going to be so many questions. Do we blow the team up? Yeah. Like, it's so many questions like that to where I think that with this Aaron Rodgers move, if they don't win this game to have some hope, this move set him back. I hope the concussion won't prevent him from playing in the game next week. In week nine, the New England Patriots will travel to play the Tennessee Titans. It would be great to win for the second time in a row. It speaks much about May's talent and potential that he receives such high accolades from one of the greatest quarterbacks in history. He certainly seems like a sculpture that might last for a long time. As further information concerning May's condition becomes available, we'll make sure to include it in our post for next week. For now, he can only take pleasure in Roger's compliments.